I uh, thank you, Carolyn and Reed for uh, putting this all together tonight. Um, having me speak at the banquet tonight, I'm really honored to, give this, uh, to have this opportunity to speak to you about my wrestling career. Um, I'd like to share a few stories. Um, when I started wrestling when I was six years old, to be honest, I really didn't enjoy wrestling that much. Uh, it was just something I did for my dad. And uh, like my dad said earlier, my real passion was football. And as I grew up, I realized that I was just too small to do anything with football. So uh, when I was uh, maybe eight or nine, I was wrestling for California Extreme. And I would go to practice and I would wrestle Shane Tucker and Austin Branham. And uh, I would tell myself, uh, that practice will be over soon, and uh, I'll only feel the pain for a couple more hours, and then I can go home and watch cartoons. And uh, for a long time, I was just an average wrestler because of that mentality of just going through the motions and just waiting out the pain. Um, it wasn't until middle school when I started to love wrestling on my own, and I started wrestling for myself instead of for my dad. Uh, and that's when a big change in my life uh, started happening. I had big strides in my wrestling career. Uh, I've had a lot of mental blocks in my wrestling career, and uh, I finally broke through those last couple years, and uh, I was able to accomplish many great things. Uh, wrestling has made me realize how uh, powerful your mind really is. And uh, making it to the semis at state my junior year, and then uh, falling to sixth place, losing three matches in a row, I really uh, focused on that summer of working on the mental aspect of my uh, wrestling.